Hi guys! We have a lot to celebrate because so. um, Anthony just got back. This whole month has been super crazy. Anthony has been traveling like in an insane amount, but he's here today. Finally back in LA to relax with my man. Yes. Last night we did a haunted house with some friends, which was super fun. We have some good news to share with you guys. I was officially signed like last week with an LA talent agent. So super excited about that. I can finally get to work, start very, auditioning. Very, very proud of my boy because we came out here for, you know, for a new start and also for him to pursue. <laughs> <laughs> so step one was getting an agency to sign on with him so he can start going to auditions and trying to get these roles and such. And I'm very, very proud of my boy. Thank you, babe. Such a good guy. Wouldn't have been able to do it without you. <laughs> <laughs> We're so stupid. I mean, I don't know if I'm supposed to say, but I will be all elite for the next four years. <laughs> Woo! He has been absolutely killing it. Like, I'm unbelievable. You guys know, like, I literally cried for the first time, I think, like, ever in the in the last video. <laughs> you guys saw when I first started, we were posting stuff, like, way back in uh, 2020 when I first got signed, and now the acclaimed my tag team. We are literally the most popular tag team pro wrestling. We're AEW tag team champions. We're the highest selling merch uh, performers in the entire company. It's insane! It really is. Like, and scissoring is the trend. Yeah, I'm actually doing it now, you guys. <laughs> Michael, what are you doing? <laughs> what are you doing? Come on. Are you about to st <laughs> to rip out some pampas? Shh, keep it on the DM. <laughs> Nobody knows. Hey, just hanging. You know, we're just here filming a vlog. Are they gone? <laughs> This is really fluffy. How do we get in Michael, there? Michael, this is gonna draw bugs. This isn't someone's property, is it? I think it is, <laughs> Michael. Wait, this is someone's property? Probably. We own it. Oh, shit. Where are we? Just on a cliff. I feel like we're about to teeter over. <laughs> Put it in the out the window, let me see. <laughs> I just drilled up on the edge. It's a nice view. Let's check out those views. It's so close to the edge. Living on the edge, baby. Oh! Look at those mountains. Yeah. This after my tire. Yeah. Oh yeah, guys, I have to get a new tire. I have a nail in it. Oh, we've driven, what, 5,000 miles on it? Was it only 5,000 miles? Yeah. Hmm. Look at this view, like, are you kidding me? It's disgusting. The vile. Putrid. It's a nice bowl. <laughs> Let's buy this house. No, I don't want that one. Why? I want to buy a different home. I want to buy a condo. I love how we told our family that we're gonna be here for like a year. <laughs> we come here and we're like, we're gonna get a condo here and then a house here. Already planning out the rest of our lives. In California. In California. So real quick, you guys, I just wanna take a second to talk about the current cost of living. People often use words like deservedness when talking about and framing discussions regarding the social safety net rather than actual fairness. Americans love to talk about pulling yourself up by your bootstraps and supporting yourself when it's really a lot more complicated than that. In good news, the poverty rate has fallen radically in recent years. Government support helped alleviate poverty in 2021 thanks to the child tax credit. It kept 2.9 million children out of poverty. At the same time, social mobility has fallen dramatically in recent years. This means that it's been increasingly more difficult for poorer American families to reach a higher class. Data shows that the federal government plays a huge role when it comes to economic stability for so many Americans. Social security is a key player in reducing poverty levels, providing a vital measure of relief. Let's continue to push for awareness and support for people who need these programs the most. It starts with having conversations to help break down the stigma regarding SNAP benefits and the child tax credit. 
Accepting help is important and so is getting the help you need. We just stopped to grab some food. I um, also, before I kept seeing Pampas grass, but I didn't realize that it was people's property because it, they, they just had a lot of property. So I didn't think that the house that was all the way like, down there was, you know, part of this land. So I'm sorry if I stole your Pampas. <laughs> I don't know what he's talking about. <laughs> I'm not in on this. You know, I, I don't want to ever be a thief. I'm not a thief. But if I see any more, I will be taken. <laughs> he hates when I film him eating. <laughs> we just left Chili's. I really can't get over the fact that my favorite salad from Chili's, salad, has almost 5,000 milligrams of sodium. Like, what the hell? That's like literally 200% of your daily value. It's just like, <laughs> I feel like they're really trying to kill us here in America. Like, I, I can't get over it. It's a salad and it has 5,000 milligrams of sodium. <laughs> I'm, I'm still shook. I can't ever get it again. So I wound up getting one of the healthiest items on the menu, surprisingly, which is a sirloin steak. Which he used and to make fun of me for, because I, I was getting. I don't even like do that. I don't do red meat like ever. But maybe it's better for me than I thought. <laughs> so i don't know you guys i'm like so over eating out at these places just too much salt too much fat yeah whatever <laughs> wow look at how beautiful it is here it is a lovely day all right we keep talking about how beautiful it is like i don't want to make you guys jealous like it's not that cool here it's really not like it's whatever it sucks <laughs> i can't look at it he's so scared Wait, is there a button to press? No. Yeah, come on. Why is he leaving? I love this. It's a pair of scissors. Oh, oh you can't open it? Oh, darn, it. darn it. Not allowed to scissor. <laughs> <laughs> no scissoring at Spirit Halloween. Oh my. <sighs> I scream at the top of my lungs. <laughs> I really want this. How much is it? I think you should get it. <laughs> Stop filming me during this trip. So we just left that little area. I stopped recording, but as soon as we turned around, the exorcist is literally like, <laughs> face is literally facing Anthony when we left. He's so scared. <laughs> hey. I'm cooking this like, um, what the fuck is this? I'm cooking this like garlicky honey chicken. So we'll see how it comes out. I'm kind of nervous about it. We went to this Asian market earlier and they had those century old eggs, like those black ones that are all over TikTok. The ones that are like green and black and blue and anthony wouldn't let me buy it <laughs> i thought it let you i thought it would be a really cool idea <clears> to eat I them on camera for you guys and he won't even try the century old egg century old eggs i wonder what it tastes like is it even good for you like what is it supposed to be like if any of you guys know anything about it let me know because i'm kind of curious about it today's the day where my guy goes goes back on his traveling Traveling uh, journey. Every week, we so, take these long trips to the airport. Yes. Together. T today is Tuesday. Um, Anthony is going to be in Virginia until Thursday, and then Connecticut until Saturday. And then I will see him again on Saturday because we have a Halloween party Saturday night, which I still have to figure out what exactly we're both going to be wearing, but we have a general idea. But it is sad, you know? <laughs> <laughs> All right, you guys, so we'll talk to you soon. We love each and every single one of you. Bye. Bye, everyone.